what is up everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Aspen in case you guys are new and if you are new I hope you are thriving today today's video is super exciting because I recently got a new backpack and I'm getting ready to go to a coffee shop and I was like why don't I film a what's in my bag coffee shop edition with my new backpack while I'm going to a coffee shop you know and I'm a coffee enthusiast and I was like why don't I have this video on my channel yet so today I'm filming a what's in my bag coffee shop edition with my new I got a Fial Raven Konkin and literally this is my new baby. It is my coffee shop bag, my grocery shopping bag, my perfect fall day bag. If you haven't seen that video, check it out. Um, but this is like my go-to bag, my carry-on bag, my whatever bag. This is my bag and it is literally just the perfect bag. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I really, I really, really just want to get into what is inside my bag because like I'm kind of crunching time here. I really want to go get a nice latte. So I'm going to go ahead and touch on the bag just a smidge. Um, so obviously I got it in yellow because the color yellow just makes me a lot more happy. Um, I think it's like my color. Um, so I got it in like mustard yellow. Um, I love this backpack because I can already tell it is so sturdy. It has a front pocket, two little side pockets, and then this literally zips all the way down to here so you literally can just peel this back and get things out of your bag. There's also a laptop sleeve in here that I will show you guys when I get into the bag, don't rush me. But this Fial Raven Konkin bag that I got retails for $8. I know there's one that's like $110 and then they have a mini version of these which I really want one of those because they're so cute just for like an everyday backpack. So I'm gonna go ahead and get straight into what's in my backpack because I'm talking for too long. Okay, let's go. In the front pocket right here, I just keep like all my chargers because like when you're at a coffee shop, you could be there for like 10 hours. I could easily be there for 10 hours. So I keep all my chargers like my laptop charger. Um, I also have my phone charger and then I have my headphones now these are like my headphones for my phone um i also have my beats in here that don't rush me i will show you guys later but just in case like i'm doing something want to listen to something on my phone and just i'm just being difficult i have these headphones they're handy and then before i dive into the inside on this side pocket um sometimes at coffee shops they don't have like vegan options or like you get hungry and you don't want to like buy more stuff um so i just have a little granola bar in here just for me to snack on um if i get hungry on the way home whatever you know so i just have a little granola bar in my side pocket perfect so like i said okay hold on but like i said this backpack literally unzips all the way down so how convenient is that um, as you can see back there is where my laptop is so there's a laptop sleeve in here and it literally fits all this stuff um, typically when I go to a coffee shop too I like to bring my camera um, and that also fits in here so just imagine all this with my camera inside the bag but anywho let's go ahead and dive right on in the first thing that I'm pulling out is of course my wallet like I need my wallet because I'm obviously going to a coffee shop to buy some coffee and I need some money so I of course have my good old wallet in my bag I have my beats in here because I can obviously connect these to Bluetooth to my laptop or my phone and yeah I like having my beats with me versus regular headphones because since they're noise canceling like I like to just focus when I'm at a coffee shop and these help me focus so I have my beats with me and then the next two things that I'm pulling out are of course my Glossier pouches because these are literally so handy to for example here to just put things in and have everything like together for my back to school giveaway I gave away one of these as like a pencil pouch so you can literally use it for whatever and speaking of pencil pouch this one I have right here it just has um some pens highlighters in it because usually when I go to coffee shops I'm doing homework um like today um so I just like to keep some writing utensils not even just for homework but like if I have an idea that sprouts up I don't want to like run up to the register and be like hey can I borrow a pen you know so I just like to bring my own um and then and that just fell on the floor and then in this pouch y'all are gonna be like you're so extra to bring all this to a coffee shop but I know that um so this pouch has like all my freshen up um types of stuff in it you'll see 
So the first thing that I have won't come out is just this little pair of fake aviator glasses. Let's put these on. Okay. Um, I like to bring these with me just in case like I want to take like a cute picture with them um, or like if I actually just want to look like I wear glasses, you know, I have these there. Um, and then next, I just have my little mini version of my Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray because, like I said, I could spend 10 hours at a coffee shop, so I want to feel refreshed. Um, so I like to bring this with me so I can just spritz some on my face, feel refreshed, feel great. It's a great time. Next, I like to carry this perfume with me. It is this Adorn Aura Court Creativity perfume this I mean it could just be like what is it called a placebo effect I don't really know what it's called but like where you think something actually really helps you I don't know but I think that this helps me be a little bit more creative plus like if I'm at a coffee shop for too long I'm probably like typing too fast and sweating so like I want to smell good um and this is citrus incense and vanilla I featured it in my urban out no in my fall haul so if you haven't checked that out, I'll put it on the screen right now. But I just like to have a little perfume with me. Um, and then I have two lippy products in here because being at a coffee shop for so long, drinking all that coffee and eating all those nice pastries, you know, sometimes your lips can get dry. So I have my Glossier Mint Bomb.com in here with me. I have like this weird satisfaction with mint chopsticks, especially after I brush my teeth. Don't tell anyone. Um, but yeah, I really like mint chopsticks. And then I also have my Generation G in here as well. This just puts a little like sheer tint of color on my lips. So like if I want a sheer tint of color, like if I want to take a selfie and my lips blend into my skin, you know, I have this to make them stand out. So there's that. And then the last thing in this pink pouch is just a hair tie because... I always have a hair tie on my wrist, but sometimes, you know, what if it breaks, you know, so I like to have a backup. The next thing that I have in my bag is a book. Right now I am reading The Self-Love Experiment by Shannon Kaiser. Um, I am going to be doing a series on my channel in January called Hashtag January. I'm going to be uploading every day and I'm putting this out in the universe because I literally don't go back to school. I stop my online schooling at December 18th and I don't start until January 22nd so I was like that's a perfect time for me to be able to do this series I'm gonna have a lot of fun things on that series but that's not why we're here this book is going to be featured in that series but I'm reading this right now because it's just a good read um sometimes when I'm at a coffee shop I like to take a break from working and just kind of you know enjoy myself read a book um so this book is in my bag because I am reading it right now um and then next I have two notebooks in here this one is just a little notes notebook where I can just write like ideas that pop in my head um anything I mean I know I could do that on my phone or my laptop but I really like to write things down um so I have a little notebook um, and then my next notebook and like the one of the last main things in my bag is my school notebook because like I said if I'm going to a coffee shop to do homework like I am today this is kind of necessary um, so yes I drew this I know I'm an artist um, I go to the New York School of Interior Design online baby and then the last thing that is in my backpack let me go ahead and whip this puppy out boy is my laptop um i got this little laptop sticker thing from urban outfitters i'm uploading an urban outfitters haul so make sure you subscribe stay tuned to that but i just have my good old laptop i also have a little marble thing on here a glossier background a glossier sticker man i'm all glossied out shut up laptop that was disrespectful I have my laptop. This is like necessary for me because like that's the only whole reason why I go to a coffee shop is to work. That was the last thing in my backpack. Then yeah, that's all that's in my backpack coffee shop edition. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you guys liked it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you guys have like any other what's in my bag blank edition videos, ideas make sure to leave them in the comments down below so i know like i really want to do like a what's in my bag like amusement park edition um or like 
you know, something like that. So give this video a thumbs up and let me know your ideas down in the description box below. Stay thriving today, people. That's what I'm doing today. I'm thriving. I'm being a girl boss. I'm doing my thing. And I'm going to stop talking now. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.